a creative guy here from uh, central New Jersey. Uh, I've been involved in music for a long time. My uh, creative side goes back to being a teenager. Uh, I was in a lot of bands, I played drums. Eventually, I started to find keyboards and guitars. I've been a drummer since I was a kid, so I knew I had rhythm in me. Uh, it led me to some lucky chances of meeting some guys to play music with, uh, especially Liquid Liquid. Uh, we did a lot of playing in Europe, we recorded records, and so it was really a, a great adventure for me. Liquid Liquid was a band formed in the early 80s, uh, classified, I believe, as a no-wave classification at that time, which I don't really like classifications. We were on 99 Records, a small record label. At that time in New York, there was a real explosion of rhythm and beats and different avenues for people to explore. So we were lucky enough to find 99 Records and we put out some records there and it was a very interesting period in for us and for New York. Creativity to me means to be able to explore uh, and be open to all types of creative avenues, be it music, be it writing, being art, and let it just come out of you what, what you feel. And I think that's the approach I've taken with music and now with art. I realized I was an artist in 2009, and I was actually at a restaurant. Uh, there were crayons there. And I started doodling around. My wife said, boy, this looks like you could do something with this. Thinking nothing of it, I bought some paint, I bought some frames, started painting, and sure enough, this part of me is now coming out. Art to me is different in the way that I don't have to use my ears. I'm using my hands, I'm using my brain, and I'm using paint and colors to create something. I'd like to mention my uh, liquid art series. Uh, this is a very spontaneous type of creation. I mix paint together, I mix it up, and what I do is mix it to a point where I'm seeing designs, I'm seeing faces, I feel a rhythm when I paint. I use all types of acrylic paint, I use paint brushes, I even use paper plates to make the designs. I've also started using a lot of materials like mirrors and I've used light bulbs. I've done one exhibit so far and it was a blast gallery in Teaneck. It was an exciting experience to walk in and to see all your paintings on the wall knowing that people will be seeing this and deciding they like it, they don't. But it was up there and it was an exciting feeling. Through my artwork I would like to make people think and see what is in a painting and what it takes to make a painting and also to show that anybody can do this if they put their mind to it and they just take the time and relax and make it happen. I'm not doing this for big fame or recognition. I do this because I enjoy it and because it's fun.